Hi everyone, in this new video, I'm going to share to all of you on how you can use and access VS Code Premium on your iOS and Android device. So, let's begin! Okay, before we start, if you're using an Android or iOS or on your device, you can check first the time cards below of this video or you can just hover around in this video so that you can skip specific operating system. So if you're using an Android, uh, just wait for 3 seconds and you will go to your specific operating system and later on it will be followed by iOS. Okay, let me just share my screen. So the first thing that you need to do is to go to Play Store and download the VS Code here. And then go to the description and tap account details and tap the link under it and once you tap that it will direct you to this link uh, for this all you need to do is just follow the unlock icon here and you need to do some steps so that you can unlock the account details so once you're finished with this it, uh, it will direct you to google docs so this process will only take you i guess two to three minutes or uh, the fastest will be a minute or two so it will direct you here once you're finished with that and as what you can see here there are three accounts but for this method i'm going to share one account because uh for the previous methods that, that i have shared before uh it it doesn't work right now and i think it will not work in the near future uh because right now i'm i'm purchased i purchased a membership account for one for one account that is why i'm, I'm only sharing a one specific account which is here and for this video uh i'm going i'm showing it here for everyone's use but once the video is published you cannot use these details especially the password to access it because i'm going to change it uh before i publish this video so these are the details here uh so what you can see uh don't, don't change anything inside the account subscription cannot proceed because of frequent password or email changes and as what i've inputted here the account details change if you try to alter some details inside uh that's the first that's the first thing that is that will be lost once you try to alter the details next is don't change the password because i can still revert it no matter what because that account this account belongs to me once you're in this part and once you understand the the things that i've said for this part uh let's go to vsco and copy and paste the account details in vsco tap see more options tap returning and tap sign in with email not sign in with google okay if you cannot copy and paste the account details or you can just type it manually on your device please make sure the details are correct before you tap sign in once you're finished tap sign in and as what you can see right now vsco will not let me sign in after two to three seconds uh the fix for this is just go to home and close the app using app switcher and then once you close the app uh, open vsco again and you should be able to access the account for some cases uh, you may encounter this but for most people they can already sign in directly once they tap the sign in button and as what you can see here if you're going to look at for the upgrade subscription uh, it is not present here because the account is in subscription here's the profile for the account and as what you can see the spaces is enabled here and as well as the other uh, membership uh, features which is only limited for those who are truly subscribed to premium version here uh, if we're going to check the customize and look for the presets uh, and as what you can see here all of the, the the premium presets are here and you can use it on your own on your own discretion uh, let's tap let me just finish it and tap cancel and the recipes are also available here you can do it or you can try to create your own recipes for your specific edits uh, what I'm asking only for you is to do not change the account password and don't change the account details and that's all here uh, the premium features are available here and you cannot see uh, a lock button which is present for those who are using a free version okay 
I hope that you understand this method and let's go right now to iOS version. Okay, for those who are using iOS device, first you, make you need to make sure that to download uh, the ESCO app directly from the App Store. And then just also a reminder that this version will only work on iOS devices running on iOS 14 or later. Uh, there are some cases that it will also work on iOS 13. But for those older firmwares, you can try to jailbreak your device or you can try to check this video which will appear on the upper right side of your screen. Okay, once you've downloaded the Fiesco app from the App Store, the next step is go here in the description and select the account details here and tap it. And tap open using Safari. And as what you can see right now, it will direct you to this pop-up here. Uh, what you need to do is select the Safari icon on the lower right side to proceed into Safari itself. Okay? For you to access the actual link. Okay? So, once you open with that, uh, it will direct you to this portion here. For those who watched my videos before, uh, if you know this process already, you can just skip ahead and do the process. Uh, in this part, all you need to do is to unlock the or to follow the process for you to unlock the, the account details. Okay, so once you once you finish with the process, uh, it will direct you here inside Google Docs. And as what you can see here, uh, there are three accounts in this video, but I'm going to share only one because for the previous methods that I've done before, it, it is hard for me to do it. Uh, I cannot replicate it anymore. And for this one, I purchased, I, purchased, I purchased a membership account so that everyone can still use it. And after publishing this video, the account details here will be different. Uh, but before we proceed, uh, please take note of this specific guide here on the upper side. Don't change anything inside the account. The subscription cannot proceed because of frequent password or email changes. Uh, this is my only concern here. Uh, don't change anything inside of the account, but you can freely use it on your own. Just don't change details or the password or anything inside of the profile of the account. So once you're okay with this, uh, all you need to do is just copy and paste the email here and the details to the ESCO. And a reminder also, the account details here or the account passwords will be will be new after the first day of the month, meaning that the account passwords for September will not work for October and beyond. Okay, just remember that. Now open and go to the ESCO, tap sign in. Tap returning and go and tap see more options and then sign in with email then once you inputted the email let me just check this one tap sign in once you're finished with that here if we're going to check on the upper left side here as what you can see, the upgrade to membership is not present uh, because uh, as what I've said earlier, this is a membership account and you can access uh, all of the premium features inside the ESCO with this account. Let's try to add a, add a photo here. Let's try a token. Okay, let's try to edit here. And as what you can see here, uh, all of the presets inside the membership account are, are present here and you can use it and also you can create your own recipes or you can edit your photos by using the tools inside of the ESCO and as what you can see here the common uh, common tools that are that, uh, that is almost locked most of the time for those who are using a free version is the remove button here and and the, the last uh, tools here are most luck for those who are using a free version. Uh, you can use effects here. Uh, I'm just doing some stuff. I'm just I'm just doing some things here so that uh, I can show that this is working. Okay, let's try tap next, and uh, you can select post to VSCO or you can just directly save it to your camera roll. 
okay so if we're going to try to look it into the camera roll it is present here here okay if this video will be able to help you for your needs uh, uh, my only request is don't change any details inside of the account uh, you can publish your own photos here just what one of my subscribers did here uh, but please don't change the Please don't change the profile name, please don't change the description, and mostly don't change the password. That's my only request for all of you guys, from all of you. And with that, uh, if you have enjoyed this video and if you want more of this in the future, uh, please drop a like and, uh, and also please subscribe and turn on that notification bell so that you can follow and see of my other videos in the future. Okay? Uh, this is me again, JC. Thank you and see you in my next video. Bye.